Our word for tonight is coming from 2 Kings chapter 4, verse 26. But the story is from 8 to 36. And I want to focus in on verse 26, the last few words. It is well. The story is centered around Elijah the prophet and the Shunammite woman. The Shunammite woman had perceived that Elijah was a man of God. So she talked it over with her husband and decided to invite him into her home so that he will have a place to stay and eat. And because of her being so nice to him and his servant, he decided that he wanted to return the favor and ask her what was it that she needed. Well, she was a great woman. She didn't need anything. She had everything that she needed. She was well taken care of and taken care of by her family. But it was just this one thing. And so he asked his servant, and the servant said that she was childless. And so he told her that she was going to have a child by the set time. Here it is, her husband is old. She ain't had no child in all these many years, so why should she have a child now? She told the man of God, now don't don't lie to me because I didn't ask you for anything. I didn't ask you uh, for a child. Do not do not lie to me. It's been all this long time. Well, the prophecy came to pass. But one day the child was out there in the field with his son, and he got a terrible headache. Could have been an aneurysm or a stroke. I don't know. But anyway, her husband told his servant to take him to his mother. So he did, and she laid him on the prophet bed. But the child died. And what she did, she sat at that donkey, and um, her and her servant, they went off riding just as fast as they could in the wind, and the prophet saw her coming and he said to his servant go see what the Shunammite woman want and so when he got there he asked her what's up what's going on is everything all right and so she said it is well now it wasn't in the natural but in her spirit it was well y'all we have to get to the place no matter what it is how bad it is how difficult it may be we have to get to that place like the Shunammite woman was and say, it is well. Even in the midst of the hardship, the pain, the sickness, disease, difficulty, death, whatever it may be, we have to get to that place and say like she said, it is well. She knew that by faith it was because she trusted God in the man of God. But see, you have a direct contact. You can go directly to God the Father yourself. And if he chooses to use a man of God, a woman of God, or medical resources or whatever the case may be, let his will be done because it is well. To make a long story short, the child was raised from the dead and received back to his mother. Y'all, it is well.